All right, folks, I wanted to make a quick video to show you how to do your first smart music assignment. I'm gonna be showing this to you on an iPad because I'm pretty sure that most of you will be using an iPad. So already we have the app downloaded, so I'm gonna choose that. And then you're gonna see up at the very top of the screen, it's gonna show the assignment that is waiting to be done. So right up here it says assignments due and it says lesson one pitch exercise. That's the one we're gonna do. And I'm gonna press the start button. Now it says select part and it means voice part. So it's gonna give you two options. If you're a guy, you can choose tenor bass and ladies, you can choose treble. And so right here where it says instrument, that's where I'm gonna touch and I'm gonna choose treble for me, and I'm gonna choose okay. So now what's gonna load it and get it all ready? The instructions that you'll see that are about to pop up are basically the instructions that I'm walking you through right now. So if you forget something, you can go back and you can read the instructions. But basically I'm gonna walk you through the screen and show you a couple of buttons that you're gonna to have to use as you do your assessment. I don't know why it's taking so long to load. There it goes. Okay, so those are the instructions I'm telling you right now. You can also see over here the rubric point. So it tells you it's 50-50 pitch and rhythm. So I'm gonna skip over and put close on these instructions, but you can read them. It's basically what I'm saying now. So here's what your screen looks like. There's the exercise that you're gonna sing. So let's look at a couple of the buttons that you need to know. Here in the middle, you've got these four circles. The first one is a microphone. When I touch that, it's gonna make sure that the microphone is working. You've gotta make sure your headphones are unplugged or if you have a Bluetooth AirPods or something that those are not synced up, okay? So I'm gonna press this microphone. And right here, for use this microphone, I'm gonna choose melodic because I'm singing a melody. I'm not playing any kind of percussion, okay? So I'm gonna select this mode and device, all right? Now, it didn't make any sound on my iPad. If I do this on my laptop, it does, it makes a sound when I press that. So let me just kind of show you the difference. On my laptop, when I do this, it wants me to test my microphone. So I press test, it makes that funny little sound and then it says you're ready and you can press start. But that's only when I try it on my laptop. So I don't know why there's a difference, but there is, so. These other buttons are the same though. The green arrow is a play button. The red circle is record. The next one is a playback button. If that's what you wanna do if you wanna listen after you're finished, okay? Now, when I look at my exercise, I need to know a little bit about my key signature so I don't see any sharps or flats. That means I'm in the key of C and you can tell that the first note there is a C so it starts on Do. Now, if you don't just have perfect pitch and you can't figure out when noticing for Do, which is most people, then there is a button here that kind of looks like an ear. When I press that, it's gonna play the tonic triad and then the first note, which is gonna be Do. So let's listen. So it played Do, Mi, So, Mi, Do, So, Do, Do. So I could practice this a little bit so let's pretend I've already practiced and I'm ready to do my assessment, okay? I'm gonna press that red record button and right above the first measure, it's gonna count me off one, two, three, four. You'll hear some clicks too. That's just like me counting you in one, two, ready, sing, okay? Let's give it a try. Thank you. 
Okay, I'm all finished. So if you look over here, it says I got a 100%. If I wasn't happy with my score, I could press delete and try again, but I'm good with my 100, so I'm gonna press submit. And I don't have any comments about my submission, so I don't type anything in there. If you did want to type something in, you could. So I'm gonna press submit and it loads your information into the system and then I'll be able to see your score. Okay. Now, if you had wanted to go back and listen to your take, um, you could have pressed the button that's next to that record button, okay? I'm gonna press close. So if I wanted to go back and listen, I could press this. And I can hear myself. Now, do you see how all my notes turned green? If I'd messed up, you would have seen red. It'll even turn red if you're going a little bit out of tune, and it'll count the note wrong for pitch, okay? So make sure that you really try to stick to your, your dough and your tonic triad, all right? That's all. Good luck on your first assignment.